if you're new to fasting or maybe you've tried it before but you're struggling to see results, honestly, I'm not surprised. There is so much mixed information trying to sell you something. Fasting Tube is independent and focusing on real information. Let's get started with today's video. The question, why does daily 816 intermittent fasting spike my LDL cholesterol? The comment by Hannes Grieven with the link to the research is pretty much what I was going to say. Anecdotally, though, I experienced this same phenomenon and it normalized after a few months of sticking with it. If you want to speed up the normalization process, try 18, 6 or even 20, for if you have the gumption. I suggest you give it 46 months and get retested. I also experienced this during my little stint with the ketogenic diet, although, while you are in the 130s, which is only slightly above the optimal range, I skyrocketed into the LDL 190s. After continuing the ketogenic diet, it normalized somewhat. I tell you about this keto experiment because, in theory, it is a similar process of fat mobilization if you are dipping into fat stores for energy as is possible with it. Lastly, when you are talking about LDL, particle size matters as well. Many researchers say only small particle LDL molecules are bad because they clump much easier and cause blockages, heart attacks, stroke etc. So, if you have high LDL but big fluffy particle size, you are theoretically in the clear. You can read more on this here. Additionally, if you are very worried, you can sprinkle in some extended fasting every other month or so to drastically drop cholesterol, blood sugar, IGF-1 and virtually any other bad biomarker. Here is an in-depth discussion of fasting and cholesterol. And if subsisting on water only for three days or more sounds daunting, read this study. Hope that is not information overload. Feel free to comment with more questions, I love discussing this stuff. Feel free, too, to peruse my other answers about fasting to see if anything there scratches your itch. Best of luck on the fasting journey.